Welcome to the Daily 19. This is day 17 of a series of 19 workouts to keep you moving during lockdown. So today's going to be a full body workout. I'm going to get you moving and then I'll explain what we're going to do. Okay, so to start with big arms back and then forward. So big stretch up, keeping the arms nice and straight just to loosen up the shoulders. One more each direction. All right, then reach above, pull down and then up. Just trying to open up your upper back, especially if you've been sat at a desk all day. All right, and then just loosen up, squeeze the shoulder blades together, open out the chest. And let's rotate round. Okay, then down onto the floor, legs straight. One leg up at a time. Let's just loosen up the hamstrings. One more each side. And take it to glute bridges. So we'll bend the legs, squeeze, down, squeeze, down. All right, let's do five more. Just try to get the glutes awake. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Come on up to your feet. Then into a squat position. So if you need to, you can hold on to something to counterbalance here. Weight in the heels, push your knees out, chest up, and you can just move side to side. Just to loosen up the ankles, knees, hips. We're going to be starting with squats. We're only going to be doing two rounds of everything today, so you're welcome. If you've got any weights, then obviously you can use them as normal. If you don't have weights, get something heavy, e.g. a book or something. All right, stand it up. So, squats to start off with. So, if you've got a weight, dumbbell, kettlebell, just going to hold it here. If you've got anything else heavy, same, hold it here. Feet in a squat position. Okay, let's get ready. Three, two, one. So, squat down, stand it up. You might want to hold the weight this way, it's up to you down and drive it up nice and controlled down and then drive if you've got two weights and you're feeling strong use them both yeah and drive or a kettlebell nice and controlled down drive up pushing the knees out and drive nice and slowly we don't want to rush it too much on the way down Let's do two more. One more. And rest, good. All right, ditch the weights. So, a while ago, we did pull downs on the floor. We're doing a little press up, pull down combination. So, you do start from here, either on your knees or knees up. You're gonna go down, you're gonna reach forward, pull down, and then back. So we go down, Reach forward, pull down. If you're on the knees, then you can push up on the knees. Okay, ready? And let's go. So we go down, reach forward, pull back down, and then up. So we're down, forward, pull down, up. So we're trying to get the shoulder blades working as well. Get your upper back working. If it's on your knees, we're down here. So just the same. I'm pulling my shoulders back and down with the knees up, down, reach forward, pull back, up, down, here, down, up. If it gets too much, drop to the knees. Here, reach forward, pull down, up, down, forward, pull down. Right, let's get at least a couple more in. And rested. Good, all right, next Romanian deadlifts. So if you've got weight, grab weights. If not, grab something heavy. Feet under hips, knees soft. Shoulders back from here. You're gonna hinge and then drive up. Hinge back, drive up. So we're working hamstrings, glutes, lower back. Okay, and let's go. So bum back, drive up. Hinge, 
Right, just to make sure you're doing it right, if you lift your toes up, then you know the weight's going to be in the back of your feet and your heels. And just think bum is going back. Hinge. So knees want to be soft, so they don't want to be, your legs don't want to be locked. So basically as straight as you can get them without locking them. All right, 20 more seconds. So weight in the heels, pushing back, getting that stretch on your hamstrings, driving up with the glutes. Keeping the back nice and straight. Okay, let's do one more. And rest good. Okay, then we're gonna go deep, uh, we're gonna go for dips on the couch. So dips, gonna work the triceps. Okay, ready. If you wanna make it harder, legs out straight, easier leg bend. And let's go. So we're gonna lower and then lift. I say, if you want to make it harder, we've only got two rounds. Have your legs out straight. It does hurt a lot more. I'm trying to be casual here. <laughs> As the mat's slipping, the mat triceps are kind of. So if you need to bend the legs slightly. All right, we've got 10 more seconds. Then we're going to get the glutes working. Five seconds, three, two, one, and rest, good, all right. Then we're gonna do single leg elevated glute bridges. So that means one leg is on the couch or a chair, one leg is elevated, and let's go. So we're just gonna do 30 seconds each side. Just try to get that glute working. All right, that's 10 gone. Halfway. All right, 10 more seconds and then we'll quickly change legs. Three, two, one, and change sides of the leg. So remember just working that one glute at a time doing this exercise. 10 gone. Okay, we're halfway. Okay, 10 more seconds. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest, good, okay. Then we're just gonna finish with, um, not finish, penultimate one, it's shoulder taps. So you're gonna be here, we've done these before, here and here. Okay, ready, and let's go. So keeping the hips as um, parallel to the floor as you can. If you need to, take the knees down, but keep the shoulders forward. You don't want to be doing it like this, because you're not really doing anything. So weight forward, alternating hand to shoulder. If you can, lift it up. Nice and controlled, you don't want to rush this. We've got 20 more seconds, then we're going to go into Russian twists. Okay, 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Onto your bum. So we did these a while back. If you've got a weight, grab it, lean back slightly, and let's go. So we're going to twist. Twist, twist, twist. If you want, you can lift your um, feet up. If your lower back starts to hurt, just put your feet down and just lean back. You'll still be able to feel it. And just really focus on getting that rotation all the way around. Well, not all the way around. You're not an owl. Just as far as you can. All right, we've got 10 more seconds, then we're back to squats. One more round. Okay, five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest good. All right, onto your feet. If you've got a weight or a foot, grab it for your squats. Three, two, one, let's go. So all the way down, 
drive up. Knees out, drive up. So nice and controlled. Remember you can also use dumbbell, kettlebell, anything heavy. Just hold it and drive. Pushing the knees out and drive. Weight's always in the heels. Okay, 20 more seconds. Then we're going down to the press up with the pull down. Okay, 10 more seconds. Okay, five seconds. And rest, good, all right. So remember, press up, and then we're doing the pull down like that. So we're just getting that W shape, loosening up your upper back. All right, so into press up position, I'll start off on the knees. So you're gonna go down, reach out, pull down, back up. So we're down, make that W shape, really pull down, and then push up. Should feel like a nice stretch between your shoulder blades. Should feel nice to get things moving. If you're doing it on your toes, or here, reach forward, down, up. All right, we've got 10 more seconds. And rest it. Good, all right. So let's go to your Romanian deadlifts. Grab a weight if you've got it. Okay, so remember knees soft, dumbbells, shoulders back, hinging, and driving it up. All right, okay, so grab whatever you're using. All right, and let's go. So hinge back and drive up. Really push your bum back. Keeping the back nice and straight. You want to think, get a nice stretch and then drive up. Hinging back and drive. So stretch the hamstrings, drive up with the glutes. All right, 20 more seconds. Then we're on to your dips. Give it 10 more seconds. And rest, good, all right. Onto your couch chair, whatever you are using. Hands on the edge. Remember, if you wanna make, if you wanna make it harder, take the feet out straight. Legs out straight. Okay, ready? And let's go. So we lower, lift, elbows back. Trying to get the triceps working. Remember, harder version, legs out straight in front of you. Make sure all the work's coming from your arms. You're not just thrusting wildly with your hips. I can feel it now. Okay, 10 more seconds. And then we're over into the glutes. Five seconds. Let's do one more. And rest, good, all right. Spin it on round, feet on the edge. Lift one foot up, other in the air. Three, two, one, let's go. So we're just gonna do 30 seconds each side. Just focusing on that one glute. So keep it going just that one side, you've got 10 more seconds. One more. All right, change sides and let's go. Hold the glute. We're nearly through. And don't let this other leg help you out. Just focus on the leg that is on the couch. Okay, we've got 10 more seconds. Five seconds, one more, 
and rest, good, all right. Then let's go into your shoulder taps. So remember, you can be on your knees or knees up. And let's go. So alternating each hand to the opposite shoulder. If you need to, on your knees. And we're doing it this way. Let's do a modified version. But remember, keep your weight forward. You don't want to have it back here because you're not going to do anything really. So weight forward here. Or remember if you can, knees are up. Ten more seconds and we're into the final Russian twist. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Good. All right. Onto the floor, ready. Get your weight if you're using one, whatever you have handy. Lean back and let's go. So we twist, twist. So we're working the abs, working the obliques. Nice and controlled. Let's say just twist round as far as feels comfortable. All right, we've got 20 more seconds. Okay, 10 more seconds. Lean back if you want to intensify it. Five seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Good, all right, so it's finished. Let's just do a sneaky little beast hold. 30 seconds, that's it. Three, two, one, and lift. And we're just gonna hold. Then we're done after this, I promise. I just like adding things on sometimes, you know. Makes a nice surprise. Okay, 15 more seconds. Okay, 10 more seconds. Final five. Three, two, one, and rest. Good. All right. Let's go into your hamstring stretch. Lead it forward. Just stretch out your hamstrings. And we're nearly three. We've got two more days left of the daily 19. Okay, feet together. Push the knees down. Into a quick quad stretch. All right, and turn over. All right, reach forward, round out the upper back. And hip behind. Quick tricep stretch. And turn to over. Okay, take it across. And the other side. And then shoulder rolls. Good, so hope you've enjoyed it. Let me know any feedback, any comments. If you want to find out more about Girls Who Lift, head to the best top and the classes that I do, then just let me know and I will give you more information. All right, thanks very much. I will see you soon tomorrow, I hope. <laughs>